Hi, it's James. I'll show you how to use the adjustment brush tool I've been working on for this new version of Affinity. It can be used to apply adjustments selectively by brushing onto areas of your image. I'm in the Pixel Studio, which contains the adjustment brush tool by default, but you can add the tool into other studios if you wish. I'll switch to the tool here, and on the context toolbar, I can choose an adjustment to apply. HSL, for example. As I hover over the document, I'll see a real-time preview of the effect. I can click drag to paint where I want the adjustment to apply, so I'll brush over some of the sky and foreground. When I release the mouse button, the adjustment dialog will appear, giving me quick access to the parameters. I'll reduce the saturation slightly, then close the dialog. I'll then switch the adjustment type to Brightness Contrast and I'll paint into just the foreground. Again, once I stop painting, the adjustment dialog will appear, and I can reduce the brightness. I'll then change the adjustment type to white balance. Each adjustment has two sets of default parameters that can be applied when painting. The alternative parameters can be accessed by holding Command on Mac, Control on Windows. Depending on the adjustment, this is typically an inversion of the main parameters, or in some cases a sensible variation. For white balance, it will make the image warmer instead of cooler. I'll hold Command, and paint over the middle of the image. Now, because this is a brush-based tool, using the number keys will actually change the brush opacity. Instead, if I hold Shift, and then type a number. I can change the layer opacity. I'll go for 50%. Finally, I'll switch to curves. And if I'm painting, but I don't want the dialog to appear when I finish brushing, I can hold Option on Mac, Alt on Windows, before letting go of the mouse button. If I hold Option or Alt before I start painting, this will switch to Erase mode so I can then remove the Curves adjustment from the foreground. The Adjustment Brush tool also has a useful integration with the Adjustment Preset panel. I'll go to Window, Pixel, Adjustment, to show the panel. And let's say I wanted to apply one of the selective colour presets to just one area of the image. If I hold Option on Mac, Alt on Windows, then click on a preset. The adjustment will be added with an empty mask, and the adjustment brush tool will automatically be selected. The primary color will also be set to white, so it adds to the mask. Then I can just paint onto the area where I want the adjustment to apply. This could be quite a powerful workflow for you, as you can create your own adjustment presets and use this technique to quickly apply them selectively. So that was a quick look at the Adjustment Brush tool. I hope you found it useful, and thank you for watching.